I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Persona 5. Now, in the last episode, we contacted that journalist with the goggles. I think she can help us figure out where the Mafia is. We're just waiting for her to contact us in some sort of way. I was leveling up in Mementos the whole time, and I was so addicted that I want to make a new episode right now. Because this is the kind of game where you just want to see what happens, and you don't want to stop playing. So, let's get into it, guys. No more talking. The journalist responded to me. Finally. Hmm. The Crossroads Bar. This is from the journalist, right? She wants to meet you there now? I guess. Looks like the Crossroads place is in Shinjuku. A meetup in Shinjuku. Sounds good. What's Shinjuku like? Will you be my escort? What's Shinjuku like? Mm. Let me see. I guess to put it simply, it's a nightlife district for adults. Ooh la la. You should send everyone a message and let them know what you're up to. Shinjuku at night, eh? That sounds rather dangerous. Where should we meet up? Stand by on. It'll be easier to move around with less of us. My apologies. I don't have the money to take the train there. Then you're on standby too. Me and Z will go, okay? Got it. If Z's going, I guess there's no need to worry. We'll leave it to you then. Well, I guess that's that. Let's meet up in Shibuya. Be careful, you two. I shall be sure to save money for situations like this from now on. You don't have money to take the train, Yusuke? Wait! Wait! Are you gonna go in your school uniform? It would be bad for you to stand out. You should change before you go. What are we gonna wear? We're not adults. You know, we don't know the nightlife. Let's see what Z is gonna be looking like. For oh, real? Oh, wow! Handsome young devil. You're still in your uniform? Huh? No choice. I didn't have time to go home. People aren't gonna notice anyways with this t-shirt over it. That's true. You stand out looking good. That's not the issue. Are you both idiots? I'm just saying now, I won't be to blame when you get caught by the cops. Come on. Don't worry about it. That place ain't so different from Shibuya. Come on, I'll guide you. If we're going to Shinjuku, we should probably hop on the JL. Just get out of this building and then the ticket gate should be on the right. It's go time. Okay, we gotta take the JL, but when we go to that district, we gotta keep everything on the DL, you know what I'm saying? Whoa, even at night, this place is bright as hell. I guess that's Shinjuku for you. Hey! Stop looking around so much. You look like a tourist. Whoa! I was just trying to find that place we're looking for. Crossroads Bar's right up ahead. I'm sure we'll get there if we keep going straight. This is so cool. Let's do some exploring, guys. Let's go up here. It looks fancy. Adults only store? my kind of store this place ain't crossroads well sorry it looked inviting hey man you want to come play touch all you want no added fees we have the cutest girls in town too i'm not interested tell me more did you really just ask that just ignore that guy you idiot no matter what way you cut it he's a shady character oh but i like shady characters and i love the cutest women in town do you have a moment Oh, fuck. Are you a student? You shouldn't be out this late. I'm a high schooler. I'm a college student. I'm an adult, man. Yep. Yep. People mistake us all the time for younger kids, though. Huh. Are you a friend of his? Wait a second. I've seen the pattern on those pants before. Maybe on the news. Oh, yeah. He was on that segment about the teacher who was harassing kids. Is that a school uniform? Whoa. Shit! You kids have got to be high schoolers. Come with me. Look hey, what wait. you did, Ryuji! Shoot! This is why I said uniforms were a bad idea! Let's run! Can we really outrun that man. cop? How much longer until we get there? Come on, man. Hey, it ain't our fault we had to deal with that detour. Our school's getting real famous. Okay. What? Excuse me! You... For the blonde one, I can sense impending women troubles, or perhaps it's something else? In any case, horrible disaster is coming for you. Please let me examine your future further. Huh? What? Me? Right. Yes, I suggest you get your fortune told. What I say will surely come to pass. Oh, or man. this shit. Sorry, but we're in a hurry. I don't believe in that stuff anyways. I see. I see. My apologies. However, if you change your mind, I'll be waiting here in this spot at night. May your fortunes be well. You know, my mom actually really likes psychics like that. She believes in them. Like when they say stuff. She really takes their words to heart. Whoa, man. We ain't old enough to hang out here. You sure this is the place? It says Bar Crossroads at the top. 
Beer, whiskey, wine. Looks like nighttime is bar time. Going in our uniforms is probably a bad idea. We got caught last time too. Just wait outside. I came all the way to Shinjuku and can't even go in? Fine, I'll kill time somewhere nearby. Just let me know when you're done. Welcome! Welcome, welcome! Hmm. How old are you, boy? Hey! Sorry, Lala chan, he's with me. Oh, boy. Oh, you picked up a real young one this time. Just don't let a minor drink alcohol, okay? <laughs> Lala chan, I'm going to borrow the seats in the back. Go on back there. I'll treat you to some water. I don't want no damn water. Ah, oh, she reeks of booze. <laughs> what a surprise. I thought you were joking, yet here you are. Yep, here I am. You I like what you see? I that bravery, so I'll listen to what you have to say. Well, what do you want to know? I want to know why Shibuya is dangerous. Who controls Shibuya? We need a name. First and last, please. Oh... Why that? Because I said so. I need intel on their boss. Hmm. Well, I do happen to know something about that. I could tell you, but... But, there's always a but. I love buts, but not when it's in a sentence. Do you know the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? You know, that case the public has been focused on lately. I might know them. Why do you ask? I was pursuing the issue of people randomly entering into a shutdown state but I'm lacking intel. Hmm. That's why I'm currently looking for new material to write about. So, do you have any info on these phantom thieves? <laughs> are those your terms? Why are you asking me? Let's say, are those your terms? We need to make this snappy. <laughs> Something like that. You're a Shujin kid, right? I remember you wearing their uniform the last time we met. I thought maybe you might have some insider knowledge on the phantom thieves because of it. Their first incident was that of Kamoshida, you know? Ideally, I'd like to get some exclusive coverage from a student who suffered Kamoshida's abuse. I would love an introduction if you know of someone who fits the bill. After all, it seems like handling this matter in the open would be an inconvenience to us both. Hmm. A student who suffered from abuse. Uh, on Mishida Shoho, what's her name? Is it Shoho? Shiho, Shiho. Oh, what about that Mishima guy? He always seems to be on the side of the Phantom Thieves. Yup. I know someone. I accept your offer. It's a deal then. Send me your friend's contact info later. I got you. You'd better be thankful. My quick wit is the only reason we're getting this far. Now that I think about it, those mental shutdowns and the Phantom Thieves both seem supernatural. Could they be related? Or am I just hoping for a coincidence? Yeah, uh, you might be too smart for your own good. Oh, sorry. I have a tendency to talk to myself on occasion. Well then, you can't exactly consider this an upfront payment, but... Tell me. Tell me! Junya Kaneshiro. Junya Kaneshiro. I think he's probably the guy you're looking for. Yeah. You know yes. when a name is in red, that's exactly who we're looking for. You should check him out further if you're curious. But I'm not responsible for what happens next. Okay. Lala Chan, can I get a refill for this kid? We need to make a toast to our new acquaintance. Yeah. It'll be a problem if you stay too long. You should leave right after you finish your water. I like how they're putting an emphasis on Z drinking water, just so Atlas doesn't get any shit from like game review companies. Oh, main character from Persona was drinking alcohol underage. Yes. Five out of 10. All right, we did it. We finally got info on the target. Let's meet up with Ryuji. He's probably trying to get the ladies. How'd it go? Nailed it. For real? Awesome. Anyways, we should meet up ASAP. I'll be in front of the movie theater, so head on over. It's that kind of open area you passed on your way to the bar. So we just have to go back the way we came, huh? All right, let's go. Man, this place looks awesome. I don't know if I want to leave yet. Let's check this vending machine. Hey, let's hurry and meet up with Ryuji. Man, fucking Morgana's always cock-locking me. Ooh, look at this pale-faced lady. Okay, 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 fine. Where are we going? Where's the movie theater? Is it over here? Movie theater. Pretty sure it's not here. If it leads to another part of town, it's not there. There's Ryuji. 
No more rules. Hey. Hey, I'm tired of waiting. You got any dirt on our next target? For real? Junior Kaneshiro? Hey. Not so loud. Junior Kaneshiro. And enter. All Here we right. go. Okay. Now we just gotta get some info on the distortion. Once we know that, it's palace time! Wait! Let's try tomorrow. It'll be better when we have the whole team together. Right, I'll tell everyone to meet up in Shibuya. Dude. This is totally crazy though. It's a huge catch. I'm pumped! Oh, a real huge catch, you say? I'm getting pumped too! What a cutie. And so muscular too. I give you an 85 out of 100. <laughs> uh, who are you? <laughs> I'm the naughty troll of Shinjuku. I'm gonna eat you up. Whoa. Hey, wait. Let me go. Dude, help. You can hear me, can't you? So this is Shinjuku. You're so popular. Show them your inner man. Huh? You're just gonna leave me here like this? Come on. Your best friend's in trouble here. <laughs> what an energetic stud muffin. I'll give you all the freebies you could ever desire. The night is young, and so are you. Let's party it up. Um, Come back alive. Well, at least Ryuji got some action, right? I mean, it was dick and balls, but at least he got some action. Hey, there's nothing else for us to do here, right? Let's head home for the night. Okay, I'm coming back there. I gotta talk to all those people who had those, like, speech bubbles above their head. Because that place looks very interesting. Did you find any clues? I have a name. You did it! Well then, let's meet up at the hideout tomorrow. Understood. Ryuji seems to be absent from this conversation. <laughs> Should we contact him separately? I'm sure he'll figure it out when he checks his phone later. We're pretty much already in Kanashiro's palace. That was surprisingly easy. Wait, did Ryuji really get some action? Because he's not texting us! Maybe he's having a menage a trois with those two guys. I do not want to picture that in my head though. Shinjuku sure was crazy, huh? It was pretty crazy. Hey, some girl just messaged me saying you told her about me? She said she's interested in me. What's this about? And what kind of girl is Oya-san? Is she cute or is she hot? Totally cute, definitely hot. You'll see. I feel like we're gonna catfish him and say that she's definitely hot. But then when he sees her, she's definitely not. For real? You're pulling my leg, right? Oya-san. She said she wanted to talk. How much more forward can a girl get? Is this really what I think it is? Could it be? Yup, good for you. Looks like my time in the female limelight has finally arrived. This is all thanks to you. I feel like starting the fan site has really changed me. Anyways, I can handle this. You introduced me, so I'll make sure I don't embarrass you. And I'll totally let you know if we end up hooking up. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not gonna happen. I can't believe you guys ditched me yesterday. I almost entered a world I want nothing to do with. <laughs> Seems like those two guys almost entered his world, you know what I'm saying? What are you talking about? Nothing. Just start it up, Yusuke. Okay, I entered Kaneshiro's name into the nav. And just as expected, it's a hit. Bingo! All we need now are the two other keywords. What he thinks of as his palace? and where it is. But we don't have any clues other than people falling victim around here. Eh, we'll just have to try whatever keywords we can come up with. Oh, it's gonna be impossible. How many buildings do you think there are in Shibuya? No complaining. If we can figure out what the palace is, we may be able to guess where it is by association. True. Hmm, it's probably somewhere he's got complete control over. Maybe a garden? A garden? Really, Ryuji? No candidates found. He likes money, so what about a money bath? I've seen people online with things like that. What's no a money bath? Found. No, not even close. How about it? Can you think of anything? A bank, a mansion, a money bath. Well, if he likes money, then obviously a bank, right? Because that's where all the money goes. I see. Yeah, baby. Okay, that's a hit. Okay. So, he thinks of somewhere in this city as his own bank. I thought it'd be something less realistic. That's all it is, huh? Well, usually the bad guys aren't that creative. Now then, 
What location would Kaneshiro think of as his bank? If we're talking about a place where he keeps his cash, maybe his own hideout? Mm. How about a real bank? His cognition wouldn't be distorted in that case. Damn it, we ain't getting anywhere. This may be difficult to explain, but doesn't it seem we're thinking a little too inside the box? Palaces emanate a passionate madness. It feels as though we're missing that aspect. The hell are you talking about? This palace is a bank for someone who extorts money with criminal acts. It's something more... But what other ways can we think about it? Oh, could it mean a place you withdraw money? Hold on. Do you think it might have something to do with the victims? He's taking money from his victims' wallets, right? That means his bank is wherever they are. That's terrible. But you may just be right. Oh, come on! How many people do you think Kaneshiro's taken advantage of in all of Shibuya? Result found. What? Wait a second. I have a hit. Huh? Oh, wait, what? D did I say something right? I guess. The place that Kaneshiro thinks of as a bank is all of Shibuya. Oh! What? Like, the entire city? Okay. I see. That's certainly that where his sense. victims are. It turns out he really is a terrible criminal. But wait, is it okay for us to go into the palace right out of a crowd like this? Eh, nobody notices if a piece of trash disappears from a trash can. This ain't any different. In that case, let's go. Let's go! Damn, so we're gonna jump in the palace this quick? I guess fighting in mementos last night off camera is really gonna pay off because I was super rusty. But now I'm back in the zone, baby. Even with the negotiations, I'm getting better at that. What are those? <laughs> what are those? Walking ATMs. <laughs> that must be his cognition of people. That's clever. That's so real clever. This is what Kaneshiro considers a bank. Nice. I never thought it would be the entire district. Look around us. The distortion is affecting the whole of Shibuya. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, that's right. Even when we were in the castle and the museum, the city outside looked normal. He sees everyone in Shibuya as his patron. No surprise for a mafia boss. It's best we focus on finding Kaneshiro's location and stealing his treasure as soon as possible. Yeah, his hideout's gotta be somewhere around here. Let's go look for it. Look over at that person trembling over there. Do you think he's a victim? We should go talk to him. How do you know that's a him? Stop assuming uh, genders. Uh, do these guys even have mouths? Excuse me, can we... Uh, please forgive me. What happened? I don't have any more, please. I'm telling you, not even one yen. Come on, man. Whoa, cool it. We're not trying to mug you or anything. Please, I don't want to end up like the others. Were you assaulted? Yeah. There's no doubt he's a victim, but he can't even hold a goddamn conversation. Let's try someone else. Hey. Excuse me, can we have a word? We are... It's no use. It's all over. I'll end up just like them. What happened? Can't you tell? I've fallen. Fallen so far. From a place where Kaneshiro leaves no tracks. What hmm? What could that mean? Hey, you gotta tell us a little more then. I'm too tired. Please, let me rest. I don't think he can speak anymore. You think? Kaneshiro leaves no tracks? Does he mean that literally? Or could it be figurative? Hey, why don't we go over all the intel we have now? They have apparently fallen quite far. Wait a second, they've fallen from a place that Kaneshiro doesn't leave any tracks? Could that mean they were actually thrown down from somewhere high up? Uh, uh what, you mean like a skyscraper? Uh, there ain't any of them around here, I don't think. No. Wait, what's that? Holy Is mother of UFOs. It? Up in the air. No wonder we couldn't find it. 
Kanashiro doesn't leave any tracks, huh? Figures it'd be floating. So, uh, how do we get up there? Can you turn into a helicopter, Morgana? <laughs> that would be dope. No, just a car. Aw, oh, man. You're useless! Come on! Don't you have some kind of secret gadget or something? Hey, I don't see you turning into a helicopter, Ryuji. Morgana is not useless. Shut it. I'm not some robot cat. I mean, I'm not a cat at all. This may be the limit of what we can do today. <sighs> we gotta find a way to get up there. Let's think about it some more tomorrow, okay? All right, we should get out of here for now. Run for it! I have a new message from Oya. Evening! <sighs> it's that woman who reeks of alcohol. You free? Yeah, I'm busy. Slow day, huh? Oh, this lady wants the younger guys, I see. All right, I have a bit of advice for you. It's about that Kanashiro guy. He's more dangerous than I thought. The police haven't tracked him down, so I dug a little deeper. Turns out he has some real shady connections. I won't say any more than that. Shady connections? He's not someone a teenager like you should mess with. You really should back off, okay? Well, that's all I wanted to say. See you. What about Mishima? You guys hit it off? Proving our justice isn't going to be easy. We better discuss this with everyone tomorrow. I've been thinking lately. About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. God damn, that looks good. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if he would have been on their side. That's all. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. Wow, that's pretty harsh. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. I feel like I'm a fly on the wall just looking into some family drama. Kind of uncomfortable. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. Ooh, maybe I should buzz away. All you do is eat away at my life. <sighs> this is so awkward. <sighs> Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just... <sighs> really tired. Hey, don't blame it on being tired. You know you meant those words. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. <laughs> what the hell? Why does Makoto get no damn respect, guys? We gotta give her some respect. I mean, first we gotta respect women, then we gotta respect Makoto. Are we out of luck? It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro. Hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Huh, that's so. You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. Wow. Useless? Why are people so mean to her? Right now, you're useless to me. Useless is the key word right now. All you do is eat away at my life. To be frank, yes. Even you too, Yusuke? Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop since you're so good at it? <laughs> I'm sorry, Makoto. So you wish to get in contact with Kanashiro? Yes. That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? Definitely. It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. Something like that. That's the only way... Not from you. No, Z, you are not going to be mean to Makoto like everybody else. We are going to say that's the only way. Hey, you don't got to answer her honestly. Well, you know what? I'm not like you, Ryuji. So you're just the good girl type to push over. Even you two, Akechi? Right now, you're useless to me. Oh, I'm not. What was that? Fine. I'll help you meet Kanashiro. 
What exactly is she planning on doing? She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kanashiro may be? I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Ugh, what is up with her? I think she's had enough. She's had enough of the verbal abuse. Because being abused isn't just physical. You can be verbally abused and the damage is more effective than getting physically abused. Because that shit lingers. So I think she's tired of that. There are way too many people here. We're never We're gonna never find gonna her. Find Nijima. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kanashiro? Oh my god, what is she doing? What? That idiot! What's she doing? Oh my god. I heard I could find someone named Kanashiro if I came to Central Street. Central Street. I know I'm breaking the mood right now, but I want someone to look at me the same way Ryuji looks at Z. She's being too rash. What are you getting at? He's blackmailing the students of Shujin Academy, is he not? Don't Tell do him it, girl. Tell he doesn't want me talking to the police about it. He better agree to meet with me. You got a death wish or something? God. What did she think was gonna happen when she did that? You don't say, hey, your mafia boss is blackmailing people. Get and then in. you expect to get away with it. You better be taking me to Kanashiro. He said get the fuck in! Oh shit. Hey, wasn't that Sure was. It's the guys that messed with us the other day. So they were connected to Kanashiro. Is she still on? Contact Kanashiro, son. Tell him we got a good one. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kanashiro san's customer. Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them. Ryuji, get a taxi. Okay, I've got their license plate. But sketching skills have come in handy. Nice. He ignored me. <laughs> I said stop. Ryuji! Hurry up and get in. So, you're seriously the student council president of Shujin. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So, whose number is this? Your boyfriend? Oh, <laughs> future boyfriend. What in the world? Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are we? Who the fuck are you? You got followed, you dumb shits. Yeah, you dumbasses. We here. Oh, that's that's nice. Holy moly! I like that. That bag you saw the other day, the crocodile one. How much was it? One million dollars. Three million. Oh my god, three million! What the fuck? Ah, for real? Better thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? Sure. It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. It pisses me off what a even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? Wow. Uh, that's... Oh damn, I got booze and cigs in the shot. Maybe some drugs too. Ah, oh, this is so hilarious. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police, 
and I'll break all of you, starting with your families. God damn! I want to give you the usual month, but well, you have such a large group here. Three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. Three weeks for three million yen. Things have taken a serious turn for the worse. That's an understatement. Three million yen? I'm tripping about three million yen for a damn bag. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. <laughs> for real. I was stupid. Yeah, that was a pretty dumb thing to do. I must agree. You should have easily imagined this happening. Hey, Yusuke. I was so caught up in trying to be useful. All right, enough of the blame game. It's done is done. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job, and she's a much more remarkable person than me. A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. But I'm still a child. So all I am is a burden to her. Hmm. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. Nah. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. <sighs> People like me must really be what others call scum of the earth. No, that is not true. That is not true Real at all. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that. And I do too. Takamaki-san. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. So can we please just drop the case with Kanashiro? Hell no. Okay, we got do. some hearts to We're change, all caught baby. Up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuji! Bank? Oh, right! The bank! She isn't useless at all! She may be our key in! Hear me out, you guys! Our key in? What do you mean? Okay, let me hear this. A cat? Um, are you all okay? Oh yeah, she can't understand what Morgana's saying because she hasn't unleashed her persona. Duh. So to her, the cash is going meow. We've become Kanashiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kanashiro's bank. I see. The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. Like, I'm just thinking about what Makoto's listening to right now. She's just listening to Yusuke talking to a cat and then the response from the cat back is just meow, 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 meow. And wouldn't you say that she in particular is a special customer? I would say so, yes. Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. Whoa, I don't follow this at all. She risked her life doing something so reckless. At the very least, she has the right to know. Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? We're gonna take her to the palace? Yes! Yeah, where are we going? Beats me. We're gonna go to the palace, you dumbasses! How would you not know that? Where are we going? You know where we're going? We're going to that place high up in the sky. Maybe Makoto 
We can ride on her back and she can just fly up there or something. I don't know how we're gonna get in there. But okay, we're about I... to do some things. It's Fox. Be quiet. The shadows are going to notice us. A monster cat? <laughs> I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice. Takamaki-san? How can you not tell? You know, you know what I mean? How can you not tell? Where are we? We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well, the world inside his heart. What? It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Another reality? It's floating in the air. <laughs> this is reality? My goodness. I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists, I can't doubt it. A reality that one's heart shows. Is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? Uh, sure. That's something we have no idea about. I see. So stealing one's heart... That may be like overriding their cognition. Yeah, yeah, sure. I think I kind of get the logic behind it. Ain't she more amazing than you? We're about the same. Then does that mean there's an ATM version of myself somewhere in this world too? Perhaps. Regardless, we can change Kanashiro's heart and make him confess if we steal his treasure. If it all goes well, that is. We'll make it go well. Everyone will notice us for sure if we take someone like Kaneshiro down. Our justice will also become resolute. Think we'd be able to give courage to those in need if it happens? For the sake of those in need, huh? You sound like my father. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. Let's if go I then. If I become a customer of that That's bank, what I'm talking about. then they'll have to let me in. real? Ooh, it came to us. She did it. It's just as I calculated. All right, guys, I guess we're doing big things in this episode. So everybody buckle the fuck up. Those walking ATMs. You know how ATMs. you can use your card to get into Come banks on, during after hours? I thought that I'd be able to get in since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue, after all. Oh, that makes sense. But wow, this place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. Being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious. We are totally robbers. Totally. You got that right. It seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on. Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer. So I'd better act like one. I will be useful for you guys. Oh, we know. We know. I can already tell she's gonna be useful. And I can already tell that she's gonna be another member of the Phantom Thieves, so I'm ready for this. Well then, let's head inside. Okay, um, can we talk to her real quick? My mind is made up, let's go inside. Okay, yeah, since your mind is made up, my mind is made up. All right, we're going in. What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. <laughs> Come at me, no, no, bro. Wait. She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. <laughs> I'd like to speak with the bank president. Oh, that was good. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let him pass. 
voice. It's Kanashiro. You mean a bank has a president? They make good money. Please wait. Reception is further into the right. I strongly advise that you do not attempt to go elsewhere. Yeah, but if we go elsewhere, you ain't gonna do shit about it because I'm gonna whoop that ass. So he said it's further to the right. Right? Reception is just past this door. Yeah, so I am going the right way. Can I attack him? Hey, that's not the right way. It's just past this door, so hurry on inside. All right, you security guard fuck. I'm going, I'm going. Reception is just to the right. Okay, to the right. They always tell me to the right. Incredible. This place is gigantic to think such a large bank. Well, okay. They won't let me finish reading it. This is the reception office. Hurry on inside. Ooh, money. I like money. How many beef bowls could I eat with this? <laughs> Unauthorized injury, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to 3 million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. Why does this motherfucker look like Hitler? You gonna call it off then? No. Alone. The interest rate is 10% a day. More like an emo Hitler. 10% interest a day? Um. Uh, that means. Uh, one day is. It's 300,000 yen. Jesus Christ! There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. If you're in the Mafia, I'm pretty sure you have people who tell you everything you need to know about anyone you need to know. So of course they're gonna know Makoto's sister is someone that's like in the law offices. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are so useful. They lack physical strength and are dumb. Hey, respect women. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kanashiro. We're gonna snatch your treasure from you. Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. You think Anyone I'm scared of that? Anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. You think I'm scared of these three stooges? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Let me show you how it's done. You ugly motherfuckers. It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. Let's go with, uh, let's go with Frey. Okay, that doesn't work. Rampage. Damn, these guys are pretty strong. What the hell? This is my other Mabufu? Please? Please? Okay, they're both frozen. But we're gonna unfreeze them with Magaru. Oh, God. Ooh. Okay, let's go with a different one. Let's go with Double Fangs. That one's always pretty strong. They resist physical? I'm ready. I'm so ready, Morgana. Show them how it's done. Nice. Oh, no, no, no. No negotiations here. It's a good old-fashioned ass whooping. And that's how it's done. Backup? All right, send your backup. Send the backup to that backup. It won't make any difference. Uh, fuck. Let me see who else I got over here. Let's try this. I need to find the weakness. 
Zyle? Okay. Uh, I don't know what it is, guys. It's not any of the elementals that I've been trying so far. I'll do Magaru anyway. Let's go with fire. It might be fire. Let me try that. Let's try some fire. Agi. Okay, it's not fire. You know what? Forget it. You're done, son. Bye bye. More backup? More freaking backup? Holy shithole. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run. No. Running is not the Phantom Thieves' way. Don't you dare run. Okay, they ran. There's no end to them. Guys. You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. This motherfucker. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough. That's why I make it a case to kill troublesome customers. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please stop! I'll eliminate others besides my goods. You've no need to worry. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful. If only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then! <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. Oh shit, guys. Shut your damn mouth, you money grubbing asshole! <laughs> Here we go! The moment that I've been waiting for! My heart's beating fast now. Have you decided to tread the path of strife? Yes. Yes. Come to me! Oh, Very yeah. well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. Yes, please! The contract! Sign the contract! Oh my I god. Am thou. Thou art I, I am thou, thou art I. Please Those are the words that get the nipples kiss. tingling. Please, never lose sight of it again. Oh, I can't wait to see what she looks like. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. <laughs> What the hell? Yes! Fuck yes! Oh, that is so freaking cool. Oh my god, she has her own bike? Persona? No, dude. That's a bike? That's a dope ass bike! I can feel it. <laughs> Myself. Me! Yes! Gun it! Gun it! Oh my god, yes! So cool. Wow! Nice! What is that? She is so badass. Like He's like, oh my god, I'm a fucking pussy. Wait, 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 I gotta get the hell out of here. I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop. Right, Johanna? Johanna? Oh my god. That was the best one so far. That was the best awakening so far, hands down. Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! You tell him, girl. Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! Go on with your bad self. The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. Right. Okay, she took the place of Morgana. No problem. Let's go with Mafrey. Because she is my bae, you know what I'm saying? Weep. 
Sweet. Okay, let's go with McFray again. Fuck it. Mm. If they're weak, we just gotta keep hitting him with it. Mabufala? Holy shit! Oh, fuck me, silly. Hold on. I gotta heal Z. I need something that'll heal Z all the way, baby. I guess just this one. Can't let Z die, no matter what. Damn. Rampage. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck. Alright, Z. Let's do this. Let's do this, baby. I'm not gonna die. We just awakened Makoto's persona. It is so badass. I am not losing this battle. Fuck that. Mm. Okay, now it's your turn. Yeah, buddy. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Ryuji. Don't worry. I got this. I got this, baby. Yes, sir. That's how we do. That's how we do. Come on. Fuck. Oh, he'll Z. Dodge it. Fuck me. No! Alright, one on one then. Damn, these guys are tough. Fuck. Not critical. Okay, you're done. And bye bye. Bitch! Let's go! Now, let's get out of here! Oh! These guys are tough. I got some work to do. I gotta level up like crazy. I couldn't even beat those guys. I gotta get up at least 10 levels. We know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. But how are we getting out? There's only one exit, right? What's up, Miss Post-Apocalyptic Raider? <laughs> do you wanna get smacked? Ooh. I'm going on ahead, so follow me. I think I'm liking this new badass Makoto. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Get in. So you'll stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality. Nor will you break through the security system here. There's not a snowball's chance in hell that a bright future lies ahead for you. Man, talk about wild. That was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. <laughs> I am so not pissing her off. I feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years, but it felt pretty great. It looked pretty great, too. I never thought I'd become part of the Phantom Thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. 
We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great. We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Yup. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. All right, guys. So we got to Kaneshiro's palace. We awakened Makoto's persona. And now we are going to try to infiltrate his palace, get the treasure, and do everything. But before we end the episode, let us read this. Damn, motorcycles are cool. I wish my persona was like that. Yours is on a ship, though. Dude, you kidding? Motorcycles are way cooler than dumb boats. That is true. It'll be just like the song. I'm a phantom on a steel horse I ride. Don't say such things. And for the record, I am most certainly not wanted. Honestly, I'm mostly just surprised how you know how to ride a motorcycle at all, Nijima Senpai. Do you got a license? A regular one, yes. Nice! Can't wait to get my hands on one too. That aside, mind if I change the topic for a moment? What is the matter? I'm sorry, everyone. I know I'm not in any position to be saying that, I truly do. However, I must apologize. It was my actions that dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions in this. If only I could have realized what was happening to Suzui-san too. Come on, we don't need to talk about that now. It seems there are still lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now is not the time to be talking about that shit though. Don't we gotta be doing something about Kaneshiro? He's right. Very well, I understand. Anyway, I will do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a while ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. But anyway, like I said, guys, we are going to figure all of this stuff out in the next episode. If you guys are ready for all this stuff to happen, make sure you give this video one nice. big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is dead, dude!